what we do here is go back, 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 back. back. And welcome back to another episode of Design with Adobe XD. My name is Michael Wong and in this episode I'm going to walk you through how to create your very first prototype in XD. As you can see I've got all the artboards opened and what I want to do is start linking up these designs together to create a click through prototype. So first things first, let's head over to the top left corner and hit prototype. Straight away you'll notice that all the design tools have now disappeared and we are now in the prototyping view. What I want to do is I want to link the login with Facebook button with the course list. So simply direct select the button. You can do this by holding command on a Mac device or control on a Windows device. Click and drag this handle and connect the two screens. You now have access to some preferences. You've got your target, which is which of course is the course list. You've also got some transition effects. So pushes, slides, and of course a dissolve and you can turn it off. We'll just do a dissolve. And you can also create smoother transitions with the ability to turn on and off the easing effects. So I like to use ease in and out. And you can also set your duration. So of course, the larger the number, the longer the duration. So we'll leave it at 0.4 seconds. That's done. And I also want to link the marketplace tab with the marketplace tab. So let's select the marketplace icon and click and drag. We'll change the transition to a none. It's done. And what I want to do is I want to link this photo of the piano with the larger preview. So it's click, drag, and let's change the transition to a dissolve, just so it nicely fades in. And what I want to do is I want to link these two screens together and create the effect of a slider. So let's select the entire artboard and let's click and drag. And for the transition, this time I want to use a push left. So you might wonder, what's the difference between a slide left and a push left? A push left will push all your existing content over to the left, and a slide left will simply slide your content above the existing view. So let's do push left, we'll leave in the easing, we'll leave the duration, and now we are done. So once you're ready to preview your prototype, head over to the top right corner and hit the desktop preview icon, which is the play button, and we are ready to view our prototype. So let's hit login with Facebook, it fades in. Let's hit marketplace, looking good. Let's hit the preview, it fades in quite nicely. And if we click anywhere on this view, we have the content slide over, so it creates that slider view. Now that's it for prototyping. I definitely encourage you to jump in, link up a few screens, change some settings, play around with the different effects. And if you have any questions, don't forget to ask in the comments below. If you did like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and also subscribe. I will see you in another video very soon.